Hi guys, this is Portable Productions and today I'm going to show you how to use the X Delta Patcher. The X Delta Patcher can be used to patch your game so you can play mods and the X Delta Patcher can be used so you can make patches so you can distribute your mods legally. On Luigi's Bigger Mansion this is required if you want to put your mods out there for other people to play so I suggest paying attention. Okay, let's get right into it. First thing you're going to need, and everything should be linked in the description, is you're going to need the X Delta Patcher itself, which I have right here. You're going to need a fresh one-to-one -one dump of Luigi's Mansion. You can either find those online or you can dump it yourself. You are going to need the mod you want to patch or the X Delta Patch itself. And then you're going to need 7-Zip so that you can open up this whole thing. Okay, so let's get right into it. So, first thing you want to do, you're going to go ahead and go to the X Delta Patcher and you're going to click on X Delta UI. This is going to open up the UI and I'm going to show you how to apply a patch. Okay, so if you want to apply a patch, just go over to Luigi's Bigger Mansion and grab whatever mod you want to grab. For example, I'll just use my beta restoration. Okay, so it's downloaded now, and I'm going to open it up on my desktop. So, the next thing you want to do is you're going to go to the Apply Patch tab, which is the first tab that should be open, and you're going to click Open Patch. Then you're going to click on the X Delta file that you downloaded, and that is going to apply the patch first. Then you're going to go over to Source File, and your source file will always be your one-to-one -one dump of Luigi's Mansion. So you're going to click on your ROM. And then for output file, you're going to click these three dots and you're going to save your mod as whatever you want it to be called. So whatever it's going to output. So for example, I will put LMBR 1.1 and at the end of your patch name, you put .iso. You're going to click enter and then you're simply going to patch. Once it's done, it'll say file patch successfully. And there is your ROM. I'll open my dolphin up right now and check. And there you go. There is the mod running. And that's it. That's all I wanted to show you guys. If you have trouble with patching your ISO somehow, just remember your ISO must be a one-to-one -one dump of Luigi's Mansion and cannot be an end kit or compressed ISO unless the patch has been made specifically for that. So if you find a scrubbed ISO or end kit ISO online, you cannot use those for the Luigi's Mansion X Delta patches unless the patches have been made specifically with those versions in mind. Keep in mind you can also find the custom version of Dolphin made to run Luigi's Mansion mods in the description as well. I highly recommend it instead of tweaking with settings because nobody wants to help with tweaking settings. So. You can find that in the description as well. It has a custom skin. It was made to run Luigi's Mansion mods in specific since most of the Luigi's Mansion mods as of this recording are not console compatible. So therefore, this Luigi's Mansion Dolphin will have everything configured for you so you can run your mods right off the bat without having or running into any errors. All right, guys, that's it. 
Uh, that's all I wanted to tell you guys. This has been Portable Productions. Thank you for viewing this tutorial. If you got all the way through, you're probably not going to have any problems. If you didn't, then uh, good luck. Alright, see you guys.